morning. It's a beautiful day to be out in the Smokies. I'm out today for a short, about five mile hike. This is a pretty easy hike. What I'm doing today is a little river trail to Cucumber Gap Trail. I'm here with my friend, Angela. There's a lot to see on this hike, a lot of uh, historic elements and part at the Jake's Creek Trailhead. The parking there is near the Appalachian Trail, the app, excuse me, the Appalachian Clubhouse, which holds a lot of memories for me. That's where my husband Jerry and I had our wedding reception and we got married here in the Smokies. And so now what we did, we just walked down the hill and we're walking to uh, the Little River Trailhead and we're gonna be starting there this morning. So let's get started on the trail today. So Little River Trail goes to the Elkmont community and this area it's pretty historic. This used to be an old town. A lot of people lived here. A lot of people came here and these were like their vacation homes. They lived in this area. A lot of the homes have been torn down now just because a lot of them were just in such bad shape. So there's a lot of remnants of old chimneys and things like that, which is pretty cool. We're gonna see the troll bridge while we're here. It's on this trail. Is what is often referred to as the Troll Bridge. pretty gradual up so it's fairly I would say a fairly easy trail to hike it goes along the river so it's nice to hear the sounds of the water as you're hiking there's even little benches to sit on along the trail kind of widens out for a minute and you get this nice little area to take a break or go down to the water. Hi buddy. Take your time, it's okay. to the junction with Cucumber Gap Trail. There's a view. There's a bench and a log. This is the direction we will be going momentarily, but we're gonna take a lunch break. Sandwich. We got peanut butter jelly today. What do you got for a sandwich? I have ham and pepper jack cheese. Ooh, that sounds good. Chips. This is my lunch. She's got a, that's it. That looks really good. Mm-hmm. What'd you say that was ham and what? Pepper Jack. I'm gonna get some chips. I don't doubt I'll eat those, but those are pickles. Pickles. Kind of oh, we just met a nice couple. They're actually hiking that direction. They're just in visiting from Pennsylvania, hiking the, in the Smokies. So, having our lunch right now. Mm. <laughs> just know to always 
carry out all of your trash anything you bring with you take out with you when you leave don't graffiti things you'll see a lot of that but yeah so i just put that out there you know as since i'm making videos about the trail about the smokies you know our smokies has been getting hit by a lot of vandals lately and so i encourage you to do the right thing We have made it to the top of Cucumber Gap. <laughs> it's about a mile of a uh, pretty um, gradual climb, not too bad. And then now we're headed down the other side. There's lots of wildflowers on this trail. to the junction with Jake's Creek Trail. All right, so at the junction, if we took a right, it would take us back to the parking lot. But we've just had to take a left. We are going to potentially go to the Advent Cabin, which is right here off Jake's Creek. I don't think it's too far. Back at the trail junction, and now we're headed down Jake's Creek to the car. Down this in the woods, kind of like old water tank or something. There's one of the houses in the Elkmont community. I'm not sure if they're planning to fix that one up or not. Since it's still standing, I'm assuming maybe that eventually they might. I'm not sure. Most of the houses in this area have been torn down. You can see remnants from the foundation right there. It's kind of full now. It was almost empty this morning. Uh, this is Daisy Town right ahead, straight ahead there. And 
and right down on the left is the Appalachian Clubhouse where Jerry and I had our wedding reception. Now you can see where they're um, starting to work on the old buildings and revamp them. I know they've already worked on some. So you can see where they've started. See how the it's white over there and then had a quite finished painting. Here's one that's done. They even got a welcome check mark to let you know you can come in and look. Oh, it's so cool to be able to come back into some place and see. I think this will be a two-story, but look, it just got really tall ceilings. I love that they've kept these old houses through here and renovated them. That is so nice. And that people could go in and kind of see what they used to look like. If you're going to visit, just be sure to take very good care and don't vandalize and Leave it the way you found it. All right, well, we're back in the car. Angel's put on her sandals. <laughs> uh, well, that was just a great day to be out in the smokings. It was awesome. So, until the next video, bye.